When I was in the third grade, I had met a stepsister that was a year younger than me. I want to marry you in the future. That's nice to hear. And I'm going to sue for damages. W what? Let's always be together. I yeah, but about the suing thing? Pinky promise. W wait, Arachan. About what you just said. If you break this promise, you won't like what happens next. Ah. You're mine. I love you, but if you betray me... B -b 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 please stop. I snapped away from my nightmare. This geek who's kind of a nobody and has no girlfriend has a name, and his name is Tsui Ogawa. But I still had a problem, too. That problem was... <sighs> Good morning, Sui. Good morning, Eddie. Your hair is all over the place. That problem was the cute stepsister, Eddie. Why are you always so late to wake up? Do you not want to eat breakfast with me? Sorry. Oh, well, I want to put the dishes away before we go to school, so please finish it quickly. That's right. My sister, Eddie, is cute, but kind of unfriendly and unfriendly, but cute. Honestly, I don't know if I'm making any sense either, but what I'm trying to say is she's unfriendly to me. She used to say that she wanted to marry me. That this miso soup is delicious. That soup that mom made before she went to work. I just warmed it up. Oh, well, you're good at warming it up, huh? <laughs> I have continued to walk into every landmine like this. I'm sure she would get tired of being around me with how many mistakes I make. What are you so upset about? I just feel like I'm such a loser, you know? You did it. You've made the greatest discovery of the century. Mm, you're not really making me feel better. Besides, why do we always go to and from school together? Because I don't want you to be involved in any accidents or crime or anything. I'm a sophomore in high school. I can protect myself. No, but you're cute, so some weirdo might try to do something to you. You don't realize that you're the weirdo here? <sighs> you're a warrior and your eyes are horrible. I'm not that cute. You're absolutely attractive. You keep telling girls that and you will be involved in an accident yourself. I only tell you that. Oh, I meant as a younger sister. I know. If you said that to me as a woman, I'd be screaming and running away. Although, even as your sister, I feel I should be screaming and running away. I have to go now. Wait, hang on. I don't want people to see us going to school together. Goodbye. We did it again. I just want to get along with her like we used to. Ah, uh, I love him. He's so amazing. I was about to jump into his arms. He only calls me attractive? That, that's basically a proposal. He loves me. He loves me so much. It's all love. But I'm not good enough for someone like my brother, so I have to treat him as cold and distant as possible, but he still follows me around. Probably because he likes me. Uh, the more I try to hold it in, the more I love him. What is that horrible and adorable creature? During lunch, I decided to go indulge in my favorite pastime, which was to quietly peek in on my brother. I'm sure if he found out, he'd be grossed out, but he's kind of dense, so it should be fine. I really want to feed him his food and make him say, ah, but if he finds out that his sister has a brother fetish, then everyone will mock him. Say, ah. Ah. How's my cooking? Good, right? Yeah, yeah, it's good. What? Stop messing with me. Oh, come on. You eat like some kind of small animal, so it's fun. I'm a human. I don't care. You're cute, so I'll feed you. No, thanks. Whatever. Can you help me out already? About your sister? Yeah, I just want to get along with her like before. Ew, you do have a thing for your sister. <laughs> I mean, as a sister, yes, but I need advice. I think she'd be happy if you talked to her every day. She's not going to be annoyed? Not at all. If she's a distant girl, then she's going to be even happier if you talk to her. Where did you get that information? From Canon, of course. Hey, Shuei! Your sister just walked down the hallway pissed off! What? Why? I don't know, but she was pretty damn furious. Her eyes were like bloodshot. What the hell happened? See, here's your chance. What? What part? If she's pissed, then a girl will fall for you if you just quietly listen. Really? I took my classmate's advice and waited after class. 
Apparently, she had left before me, though, so when I got home, her shoes were already there. I headed to her room, but... Adu! Huh? She's not here. Maybe she's showering? Hmm. Adu wasn't there, but the PC was on. Apparently, she was looking through photos. There were photos of us together on the monitor. Wow, that's an old picture. And the name is my lovely brother? Adu. She's been looking at these photos after getting home. The fact that she was looking at her old photos actually made me a little happy. I did feel a little guilty for messing with her PC, but I took a trip down memory lane and displayed all the photos in order. However, something started feeling off about the photos. Huh? When did we take these photos? From around middle school, it started just being photos of me, and none of them were looking at the camera. I didn't have any recollection of having these photos taken of me. There are some from when I started high school. There are photos from when she completely became distant to present day. And a single photo every single day for 365 days? This is weird. I felt my spidey sense tingle, so I put the screen back to where it was and got out of the room in a hurry. Then... Sui? Whoa! Edusa? Why did you just come out of my room? I had a little thing to do, but I got it now, so don't worry. Please just don't go into my room when you want. Yes, I won't ever do that again. Okay, goodbye. That was weird. What was he being so nervous about? And he's not talking like usual. It's like he saw something in my room that he wasn't supposed to see. Wait, did he... You saw? That night, I said I felt a little sick, so I didn't eat dinner. I stayed in my room all night. I wanted to organize in my head what I had just seen. Why did she have photos of me? Why was the name of the folder my lovely brother? The next morning... Hey, wake up, it's morning! But today's a weekend. It's a weekend, so you have to take care of your sister. Take care? Good morning, Sui! Hey, what are you doing in my room? I came to wake you up. <laughs> your hair is a mess again. <laughs> I see. I'm dreaming. She wouldn't talk like this. I'm going to give Mr. Sleepyhead a kiss. See, I'm dreaming. There's no way she would do this first thing in the morning, or noon, or night. Okay. Mwah. Huh? Oh, dang. No, not dang. What are you doing? You wouldn't wake up, so I was going to give you a good morning kiss. What has gotten into you? And I'm handcuffed? Why? Is this some kind of prank? No one would benefit from pranking you. I mean, yeah, but then what are you pranking me for? What's going on? You looked through my PC without asking, didn't you? Uh, n uh, no. Why are you trembling then? Because you handcuffed me. You know, lying isn't good. If you lie, you won't like what I do. Uh, that line. I whispered it into your ear every morning. That wasn't a dream? So, what are you going to do? You keep lying to me and... Sorry. I mean, I didn't mean to look. I see. So you did look. I told you, let me free. That's my love. What are you talking about? Did you understand that I love you a lot by looking at my collection? Yeah, it's a little misdirected, but yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to change it. Uh that's a good thing to... Your logic. What? Why me? I need you to like me as a woman. You're too close. You said you'd be with me forever when we were younger. Y yeah, I did, but... But you're trying to break that promise. What are you talking about? Besides, you were always unfriendly to me. So what? Does that mean you don't like me, right? Nope, I like you, so I wanted to keep a distance from you. What do you mean? I just can't contain my love for you sometimes. Yeah, like this. It's your fault. You just keep making your younger sister all into you and I'm clearly acting like I don't care. I'm sorry. I won't say it again ever. Ah, uh, I just want you. You're way too close. I've been holding back this whole time. I think I can't hold back anymore. You need to handcuff yourself, not me. I'm not into that kind of thing. But that woman? What woman? 
She awed you. I don't believe it. Uh, are you? No, you don't understand. It's a misunderstanding. There's this punishment that has been going around in class. Punishment? If you lose, you have to pretend to be dating with a boy in class. Specifically a boy you don't like. One of the girls is messing with me because of that. That's why she had to... Uh... Um, what's wrong, Eru? What the hell is that? Uh, that pisses me off. I don't care, but thanks for being mad at me. You don't have to bite your lips like that. That punishment game is the best thing ever. Huh? That's why you're mad? If I were you, I'd lose whatever bet and completely flirt with you as much as I could. It's a punishment game, but I'd tell you that I really love you and I want to marry you. So, let's play a game. A game? You pretend to be my lover for a week. I'm going to make you fall for me in a week. Seriously? You don't want to? If you don't want to, you can say no, but but you might never be able to say no again. N no, it's not that. It's just about my dad and, you know, food. This bipolar atmosphere is freaking me out. Dad and Mom are away for a week on vacation, so it's just us. We've got enough food, so we don't need to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. She's totally prepared. Fine, I'll obey, so just take the cuffs off. The game starts now? Okay, fine. I'm letting you free then. But if you try to run... Okay, okay, I get it. This is weird. I did want to get along better with Eidu, but this isn't what I wanted. Then how about we purify ourselves before eating breakfast? Purify? It's... Bath time. Ah, yeah, you can use your imagination there. Say ah. Uh, ah, ah. How's your sister's amazing cooking? It's good. You're so cute. Do I just be your prisoner like this? No, I wasn't born to cry. I was here to fight and win, to smile. You've got this, you've got this, Sui Ogawa. Her own good. Damn it, Edu, enough is enough. Sorry, Sui. Huh? About what? This is insane if you think about it. Uh, what are you talking about? If I had just told you the truth to begin with, this wouldn't have happened, huh? Y yeah probably Then if I had just gone back to before I was unfriendly with you, would you have dated me? I don't know about that. Right. So this is the right answer. Ah, uh, I chose the wrong answer. I feel like I'm just digging my hole deeper and deeper. She was just going to continue trying to get me to fall for her and her antics are completely insane. It's pure lunacy. Then I need to fix her logic slowly. Edu, do you have a second? What is it? Uh, can we do something that's like normal dating? Normal? I don't think it's normal to restrain someone or lock them in your house. You're not completely wrong. So we can go outside and go on a date or something. You won't run? No. Phew. We finally made it outside at least. I'm so excited for our date. Where are we going? <laughs> She's just normal and cute like this. Well, how about we go check out what's in front of the station? Once we made it there, someone started talking to me. Oh, hey, Sui. Is that your sister? Oh, what a coincidence. All right, I'm going to ask her for help since I ran into someone I know. Hey, can I talk to you real quick? What is it? You're all friendly with your sister. <laughs> uh, so about that. You little sister lover, you. You're getting along fine with her. No! Wait, my brother was a sister lover? Yeah, he came to talk to me. Something about advice on how to get along with his sister. Stop! Alright, looks like I'm in your way, so I'll see you later. Wait, hang on! Suey. You take good care of her. She showed up, talked, and left on her own schedule. What? You really did like me? Crap, she figured it out. You wanted to get along with me. That's adorable. That's definitely not where I wanted you to go. We had fun on our date and went home. She is quite the dangerous yandere, but it's not to the point where I don't like her. If anything, maybe it's nice that someone loves me this much. It was pretty sad when she was unfriendly with you, right? And now it's just the opposite. One week later. Eiru, I can't go out with you. Why? 
You were unfriendly to me for a long time, so I don't know what's the real you in a week. Suey? But that's why I want to keep being with you. As your sister? No, as a woman. I also thought of you as a sister for a long time, so I want to try to figure things out and switch to woman. So can you wait a little bit until I can understand a bit better? So you're thinking about me and our future? I mean, I guess so. Is that okay? Of course that's okay. I'm going to keep working hard so that you can look at me as a woman. <laughs> Don't go too far. We're always going to be together, Suikun. I had apparently lost a bit between us, but her yandere really went somewhere and now she's just a regular cute girl. This is a story for another day, but when I asked our parents if it would be alright if we dated... Yeah, go for it. Why is he talking like he doesn't care? Whatever the case, they're okay with it. 